eyebrow, upper lip, and chin waxing. A facial waxing service can really improve a client's appearance and give them a lift. These services can be performed with the client reclining in a salon chair or lying on a waxing bed. Let's start with an eyebrow service. Use a headband to keep the client's hair out of the way. First, trim the brow, removing any unruly hair above the natural brow line. Cleanse the area with satin cleanser and wait for it to dry so the wax will adhere properly. Measure the client's eyebrow with a petite applicator. Start from the crease of the nose. This is where the eyebrow should begin. Follow to the highest arch and end the brow when the applicator is lined up with the corner of the eye. Use your thumb and forefinger to pull the brow up and apply the wax across the area in one smooth stroke in the direction of the hair growth. We are using zinc oxide wax for this client. Apply a cloth strip to the wax, press firmly in the direction of hair growth. Hold the skin taut. Quickly pull the strip straight across the forehead in a forward motion in the opposite direction of the hair growth. Keep the strip close to the skin while pulling. Immediately apply pressure with your index finger for a few seconds. This will reduce any tingling in the nerve endings. Repeat the same steps on the other eyebrow. And then proceed to the area between the brows. Apply the wax in the center of the brows and then remove the wax with a forward motion against the direction of hair growth, keeping the strip close to the skin. If there is any wax left, do not dab at it with the cloth, but use the same pull punch method described here. As always, use Satin Smooth Satin Release to remove any remaining wax and follow with Satin Cool and Satin Hydrate. For waxing the upper lip, first determine the direction of the hair growth and cleanse the area with Satin Cleanser. We are using ultra-sensitive zinc oxide wax. You can use a hard or soft wax, it is your choice. Apply wax starting below the nose in the direction of hair growth and move down to the lip in smooth, firm strokes. Starting at the corner of the mouth, remove wax in small sections with a small cloth, working towards the center. Remember to apply pressure with your index finger after each section is waxed to reduce any tingling of the nerve endings. Repeat the process on the other side and then layer post-waxing treatment in this order. Satin Release, Satin Cool, and Satin Hydrate. Many clients choose to wax hair that appears on their chin, particularly if it is dark or coarse. Cleanse with Satin Cleanse and let skin dry. We will be using Wild Cherry Hard Wax for this service. Apply wax in the direction of the hair growth and remove it in the opposite direction. Finish the service by layering Satin Smooth Aftercare products.